from your local weather authority. Here is meteorologist Ryan Michaels. Well, folks, what a beautiful start we've got in our skies. Despite a little bit of the uh, residual cloud cover left over by showers and thunderstorms across the south yesterday, those stratus clouds are lighting up gorgeously. There's beautiful breaks to allow for a wonderful glow out there on the horizon and beautiful colors here for us in our skies as we start off our daytime. A partly clear sky, 76 degrees at the airport in Bay County right now. Dew points in the lower 70s as well. It's pretty humid outside, very warm and humid to say the least but maybe not as much of a steam bath as it was yesterday. Look at the lower 70s that you see across I-10 here this morning. Some of those showers and thunderstorms we had yesterday able to cool the atmosphere just a little bit. I don't want to oversell that, though. We're only down about four or five degrees from yesterday, and overall it still is uh, pretty swampy outside, especially down towards the coast. And it's been that warm and humid air mass that's actually led to a couple stray showers down toward uh, Gulf and Franklin counties here this morning. It was a pretty good thunderstorm there for about an hour over Port St. Joe already this morning. That's now diminished down to just a shower over Apalachicola and St. George Island. We've got northwest steering flow today as opposed to the westerly steering flow we had largely yesterday. Anything that developed in the Gulf yesterday was able to easily move on to the coast. But because of the northwest steering flow, well, it's going to be kind of hard for us to get that morning round in store for us today and as well as tomorrow. This is a look at our steering flow in the atmosphere, which kind of guides some of those showers and thunderstorms around. Now, while we might miss out a little bit more so on the morning round here on the coast, I still think that once we get enough heat of the day, we'll still scatter up some showers and thunderstorms for us as we go into the afternoon. A little bit underdone even on this particular computer model. I anticipate them to be widely scattered. You'll have to battle them for about a half an hour, an hour's worth of your afternoon across the panhandle. And otherwise, see pretty hot and humid conditions. We'll warm right back up into the 90s here for today. Outside of any scattered storms this afternoon, feels like temperatures in the triple digits. Now again, that 70% isn't 70% of your day that you're dealing with shower and thunderstorm activity. It's only going to be for about a half an hour or an hour's worth, but these scattered storms will be around. The afternoon, probably your better chance of catching it. I just think about almost three quarters of the panhandle will probably have to deal with shower and thunderstorm in their skies for about that half an hour, an hour, almost each and every day this week and into next week. Okay, folks, stay with us. We're back in a couple of minutes.